Hey youans, welcome back to my channel, 20BLV Mouth of the South, no intro, no outro, just these hoes. Okay, we have a real treat, as in treat from around the world. Actually, we got these treats sent to us by TryTreats.com. It is a subscription service that you can try treats from around the world. They start out at really cheap. Like, I think the intro box is like $14.95. So, it's a really good thing. If you guys are seeing shadows and stuff behind us, it's just that I don't... Guys, the purse room is a mess. And number two, we just like to do different place, do it in different places yeah. in our house. <laughs> Actually, we just thought, you know, we'll we'll come into this room. So if the lighting is off and the, the sound, I do apologize. And my camera wants to do this thing where it really exposes our faces. And then it, I'm looking up the fix for that. So please be patient. And we'll be back in the purse room probably next week. Yeah, we're, we're in my junk room now. So. Yeah, we're in his guitar and musical room. So anyway, trytreats.com. They sent me a letter. Dear Winnie BLV, thanks uh, for accepting a box of our international treats and snacks from trytreats.com to try. And there is an exclusive promo code uh, if you use my link, which will be down below, Winnie BLV, which is a 15% off discount on your first box that you purchase. This is a cool thing. I really do love this. Um, we've done this a couple times before. I know Devin and Kevin like to do this. We've done it with Gwenny and the Lion Mark. So it's just fun. So let's open up. Cool little box. Yeah. Comes in a nicely packed mm -hmm. box. Ooh, that's what she said. Oh, hell yes. And it comes wrapped up very nicely. If we could show them. Man, there's lots of stuff in here. I mean, you get a heap of stuff. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so Bill and I are just going to... Hold it. We're just going to hold it. You hold, I hold and it. And we're just going to start out. Some of the stuff is in, I want to say like Chinese or Japanese, well, Japanese, Japanese it looks like, characters, so we can't really say what everything is, but what do you think? Oh man, this is so cool. So meow meow, that's cool. Cuttlefish flavored crackers. Wow, I do love fish. Amki sesame snack to go with honey. Okay, right. okay let's, let's, try. let's start her out. Uh oh, this one's very fragile. It looks to me, this first snack, Rice cake. Kind of looks like a rice cake. It looks like like maybe one of those little breakfast wafer mm -hmm. things that you get. Oh well, I think it's three pieces, yeah, but stuck together. Oh god, god, it's not bad. You can taste the honey. You can smell the honey. Mhm. Mm oh. so this is called Amki Sesame Snack with Honey. Okay, so this to me not my cup of tea. I don't really love it. It reminds me of the thing that you, like a breadstick, a sesame breadstick you get in Italian restaurants, only drizzled in honey. It's sweet, but it's got a real bad bite. It's got a, bad like I you can taste that sesame. Yeah. It's probably healthy, it's probably weed up. Yeah, it's Why we like it. <laughs> yeah. So this one's a Dolcetto Premium Wafer Rolls with no high fructose corn syrup. Oh, that sounds good there. It looks like those Purettos or whatever. You know what I'm talking about, mm -hmm. Purettis or whatever you. Or we've got in the can eat that. Uh -huh, yeah, they come in a little can. They're good too. God, I love those. Don't let these be like that. My little editor guy's like, oh God, it's taking forever. It comes in a little damn case. Okay, girl, yes. It comes in a little little tray. That's what these are. Yeah. Definitely. Looks like an Italian treat. Yeah, it looks like a cigar. We haven't smoked in years. It tastes like it. Oh yeah. They're That's good. what these are. They're good. That's good. Mm -hmm. I like that. I would like that with my coffee. All right. And that was the Dolcetto. Did I say Dolcetti before? Good. Mm -hmm. This one is from Nestle. Looks like it's maybe a Spanish treat. Maracas. Morachas. Maracas or morachas. Little cookies. <laughs> I brought my drink in here. <laughs> I did too, just in case. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So. Hadn't fell apart there. Mm -hmm. It's good. Mmm. Yeah. That'd be good with some cold Coffee. milk. No, or a coffee. Mm. It's like a reverse Oreo. That's good. Kind of. I like it. 
I like that one. That one looks good. This looks like a jello shot. Yep. Oh my God, it is. It just says who it's made by. It doesn't say what it is. So you get, I get the orange one and you get the green one. I guess. It does look like a little jello shot. I feel like I'm gonna open this and it's gonna it's splatter cute. all over me. And <laughs> normally we're okay with that, but not on camera, girl. Oh Lord. Yeah. Okay, it's it's a gelatin. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's very fruity. Well, it has fruit on the lid. It seems like something they would give you in the hospital. Yeah. Like, you know, they give you that stuff to take, and then so, like, right before you have surgery. What do you think? Oh, you just squeeze yours all in? Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a little tiny jello it's jello. It's good. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. jello. Mm -hmm. This is called margarita. Okay, girl. Yes. Alto en grasas. Okay. I she knows not what she says. These are treats from around the world, guys. So, and you get different stuff every time. So that's cool. I like a treat box. So let me a good treat box. Yes. That was good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is called marachas or margaritas. Oh, that, the last thing was marachas. We love that. Mm -hmm. so it's a cream in between the cookie. Mm-hmm. Mm. I like vanilla wafers with some cookie stuff, cookie cream in the middle. Yeah, it's not really a, uh -uh. not really a sugar, I mean a, uh, mm -mm. I think we ate it. Is there anything in the middle? Yeah. No, wait a minute. No, there's not. Look, we're over here like, oh. there's something in the middle. It's just like those tins of Danish butter cookies that you get at Christmas. Oh, good. Pretty good. I ate that with coffee. I love a little sweet scent with my coffee. I don't mm. know if you guys can tell. We're doing all the sweet stuff and then we'll attack the chips. Or cuttlefish flavored cracker. Other places in the world call them crisps, like uh, England and and uh, Scotland and Ireland, Wales and Australia, and maybe New Zealand. I don't know. But what the heck? So I opened this without. Okay, some of it got a little crumbled. It's a little wafers. Jacobina. Jack what? Jack. I know, right? Jacobina. I don't think I keep putting them together, but. No, that's good. That's together. Mm mm. That's different. There's not much flavor. Oh, not have no. Mm. That's just as if you'd eaten a piece of cardboard right there. Yeah, not much flavor to that. But most of them have been pretty good. Milkita, Milkita. I don't know. You try that one. Which what's, what's the flavor of it? Vanilla shake candy. And here is a chocolate shake candy. Okay. You want to try the vanilla or the chocolate? I don't care. So it comes like a huge horse pill. <laughs> I was like, it's just soft bite. It. It's like taffy. I'm gonna break my teeth. Mm -mm. It's not bad. It's lot. Mm. I can't get mine to one moment. The chocolate. Mm. It's pretty good flavoring. Mm. But it's lot. It's kind of okay. So I know this is gonna take everybody back. But my grandmother used to try these little diet candies when I was a kid, and they were called AIDS. A Y D S, I think. Mm -hmm. And you know what happened in the 80s, unfortunately. So those candies, but she would always try those were supposed to curb your appetite. That's what that tastes like. This tastes like a let me know down in the comments if you remember. A, a, a really old Tootsie Roll. Yeah, I didn't I don't I don't like Tootsie Rolls, so therefore I would not care for that. So I, I wasn't a fan of that, but you'd like Tootsie Rolls, so yeah. Yeah. You kind of would, maybe. So this one is the one that's get yours. It's that's in hard, Japanese. That's hard candy. Mmm. Wow, it's really good. It's watermelon. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I'll no, take your word for it. I won't open it. It's good. Here's a, another green one, an apple one. There's a bunch of little loose, whoops, loose candies in here. Wow, that didn't even fall. Mm. But that's a hard candy. Yeah. Yeah, it'll take a while. It was gonna take me a while. I was saying, mm -hmm. yeah. this is the strongly, seriously oh, cool. strong triple X extra Pepper. strong mints. Peppermint. You want, you want to wait till we try the chips and everything, and then try the peppermint to as a get palate the cleanser. Out? Yeah. Okay. This is called the Meow Meow, the House of Snacks Cuttlefish flavored crackers. You know what's funny is this is it's out of Canada. Canada's trading company. No, it's California, California or Canada? Yeah, California. I see a CA, but I'm not sure. I think that's... It said it's actually a Malaysia made in Malaysia product. Okay, so this must be a treat that is mainly in Malaysia. God, the bag is like vacuum packed, girls. We're going to have to cut into that. It's like... There's no way. Not your normal package. Yeah, there was a lot of vacuum packed in there. Yeah. Oh my god, it smells like fish food. Oh, it smells exactly like Let me fish food. Who? Ah, oh god, <laughs> they look like little prawns. Mm -hmm. I go, ew, and then eat the rest. Nothing I 
would spit it out in the box. Very fun trying it. Ooh. A couple of things I really did love. Most of the things I really did love, I think they're good, good, good. Now this is the same Malaysian, but this one's artificial chicken flavored crackers. They're not really chips. The house of the meow, meow, meow. The house of snacks. Meow. Yeah, you have to be a cat to eat that. <laughs> oh. oh, the aftertaste is there. It's awful. That's why I had to take a drink. These look like chips. Little crackers. Okay, yeah. Those are good. I'm going to get down with that. This would go well with dip. Third. Anybody had like pimento cheese down south? We have pimento cheese bread. It's it's so actually can... got a little sweet flavor to it. Mm -hmm. Well, good. It's like those fake funions you used to be mm -hmm. Yeah, the they're like an of... off-brand funion. Yeah, they're really good. That'd be good not with some chicken hot sauce flavored in though. That bag and... Yeah, we love yeah, hot sauce. Not much chicken flavor to it. We put that on everything, yeah. just like the commercial says. Okay, right. so let's try the peppermint. The last thing, did I stick it in the wrong box? Ooh, girl, she can't do that. This was a fun experience. I liked it. I enjoyed it. Don't forget trytreats.com. Go down in my box, roll around, and find. It'll be right on the top where you can it's go over there. It's fun to try. I mean, it would be something that I would enjoy to do. You know, well, we every month. We found a couple of things out of this box that we didn't appreciate. So, but overall, yeah, it's, it's just it's pretty, pretty good. good candy. It's different from what we're used to. You know, in the States, we're used to everything so sugared up. and This is like an Altoid on steroids. Like, just open it. Oh, my God. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like eating three uh, peppermints in oh my that, that wintertime. It's like cold feeling. It is weird. Triple X. I actually like that. Yeah, I like it too. It's a good after dinner mint like uh Ooh, it gets a little strong. Mm. Oh my god, is this strong or what? <laughs> it gets a little strong. Seriously strong peppermint XXX mm. extra strong mints. So there you go. I wanna thank trytreats.com for sending us this little joyous bundle today. I really had a good time with this. Don't forget, use my link if you want to just go there and check it out you know no obligation guys but if you do want to try the try treats just put in my coupon code WinnieBLV, and that will get you 15 percent off all right so that was fun that was that's, a fun little like a, like a peppermint mm -hmm. altoid kicked in yeah. yeah altoids used to make i don't I, and you can't find them anymore i used to love mm. dark chocolate on the altoid the two flavor Ooh. like you just crunch them up real quick they were so good but they don't make them anymore chew it mm. mm -mm. Oh my God, she is strong. Mm. <laughs> I chewed it up, and you chew it up. It's it's like having you know what Hall's cough drops are like. Yeah, with the mentholiptus and mentholium. Ooh, it'll clear you out, girl. Ooh. Like woo, open the sinus passages up, which I kind of need that. All right, well, thanks again to TryTreats.com. Go over and check it out, like I said, and find my promo code if you'll do me a huge favor and hit that subscribe button. What are you waiting for, honey? Woo! It's a party over here. You, and uh, also hit the notification bell. That way you'll know when we post or I post new videos. I hope you guys have a great rest of the weekend. Tomorrow's Sunday. We're just going to relax and enjoy it. And do me one solid. If y'all see my husband, that's him. Don't tell him nothing. Bye. So... <laughs> We had this discussion last week about continually, are we over luxury? I have decided that I am going to stop chasing every Tom, Dick, and Harry. I'm going to really concentrate on Dick. <laughs> My buddy John sent me that meme. I know that's floating around right now. I told him that the other day, and he was like, woohoo, all right. <laughs> Let's just hope you don't get in YouTube jail. YouTube jail? YouTube jail. Mm. Girl, get you some of these streets, bitch!